Hey, welcome back to Will J Gaming. I'm Will J, and this is the second episode of our Pokemon Sun and Moon walkthrough. We're just entering Iki Town as we go on ahead through here. All right. Huh? All right, so there's that same girl that we saw in the intro. Let's go follow her. Well, first, let's find out what's up here. No, there's nothing up here. All right. I mean, I'm really anxious to get my first Pokemon. I mean, I really want to do that. And I also like how the game, we like, the running shoes right away instead of how we have to, like, go all the way to, say, Route 4 in order to be able to run. No, you can't come out. We'll get in trouble if anyone sees you. Okay, who is that? Well, that's a new Pokemon. Uh oh. Okay, I recognize that one. Let's go help her. Never mind me. You have to help it, please. Save me, B. I guess that's its name. But I don't have any Pokemon. How can I fight the Spearow? The Spearow are attacking it. Wait, do I get my first Pokemon from... No, I'm supposed to get it from the Guru. But I'm too afraid to go out there. My legs feel like they might give out. Whoa. Alright, I'm gonna try to walk. Oh. 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 Whoa, that's a powerful Pokemon. Uh-oh. Well, can it stop me from falling off the bridge? No, but that one can. Is that hers too? Phew! Oh, thank goodness. You tried using your power again, didn't you? Oh, maybe. You know what happened the last time you was that you couldn't move for ages after that. I don't want to see you like that again. No, I shouldn't say that. I'm sorry, maybe. I know you were trying to save me that time, and I couldn't even help you in return. What is that? It looks like an item. Pew, pew. That's a sparkling stone. Oh, is that a mega stone? Please forgive me. I'm so grateful from helping you, from helping us out of this dangerous spot. Who are you? I think this stone must belong to you. 
Alright, I obtained a sparkling stone. Is that a mega stone or an evolution stone? I don't know. Alright, so I put it in the, in this and I opened up the oh different. Okay, never mind. Please. Don't tell anyone about this, about seeing me be. It's a secret, okay? Come on, into the bag, maybe. get attacked by some wild Pokemon or something. I know it's been too much for me to ask it, but could do you think you could take us back to town? Yeah. Alright, so we're back to Ikki Town. Hey, looks like you missed the Kahuna. But you found my assistant, oh yeah? Looks like we already met, but just in case, this is my assistant. Oh, um, yes, you can call me Lily. And this is Willie J. He just moved here to Aloha. Take good care of him. You're also one of the professor's acquaintances. It's nice to meet you. The Kahuna is back. The Kahuna Hollow has returned. Our guardian, the chosen one, is back. Only the strongest Pokemon users in Aloha, oh yeah? That's the Kahuna? <laughs> if I miss something? No, but where'd you go off to, Kahuna? I thought we were meeting here. I'm the Kahuna of this island, after all. Whenever there is a problem on the island, it is my duty to resolve it. Sorry, Lily, what were you saying before? For some reason, I, saw, I thought I saw Tapu Koko flying out. Um, yes, Kahuna Hala. Maybe he was being attacked by some sparrow on the plank bridge when this boy helped it get away. But the bridge collapsed, and I thought both of them might fall into the ravine. And that was when the island's guardian deity swooped in to save them. Ooh, that's something you don't hear every day. Oh, although it's said to protect us, it is a rather fickle creature. Tapu Koko, yeah. Le yet our guardian was moved to save you. Kahuna, my boy. I think we have a cause to celebrate. It seems like I should entrust this brave and kind young boy with Pokemon of his own. We'll make a fine trainer out of him. I'm glad to meet you, child. I am Hala, the Kahuna of Meme Island. Welcome to Aloha, young Kukui. Had m told me if you're coming. I'm glad we get the chance to meet today. Come on, Pokemon, let's have a look at you. Wow, I don't recognize any of those Pokemon. They're all new. The grass type Pokemon, Rowlet. Woo, go! Looks like an owl. The five. The fire type Pokemon Litten. He looks like a kitten. And last is the water type Pokemon Poplio. I don't know what he looks like. But he since he said bark, he might look like a seal or maybe a dog. I I don't know. Which Pokemon will you choose as your partner? 
Alright, which do you think? Should I choose the grass type Pokemon Rowlet, fire type Pokemon Litten, or the water type Pokemon Poplio? What was that? What? I can't hear you. Alright, if you have a suggestion, leave it in the comments below because I'm going to end this right here. Sorry, so sorry, but. Alright, so this has been the episode 2 of Will J Gaming's Pokemon Sun Walkthrough. And as always, thanks for watching.